Yo guys, how's it going? Mad Gas here, and for today's video, I'm going to do another character creation video, and this time, I'm going to attempt to try and create Nico from Grand Theft Auto 4. Now, if you just follow what I'm doing on screen, you should be able to get some sort of ballpark area for Nico. You can make different tweaks yourself to actually make him look more like Nico Bellic. But this is just my take on it. It was literally done in a few minutes. I didn't really spend a lot of time perfecting different things because I believe that it's so hard to do it with this character creator, like the plastic surgery options. There's not a lot. Of, it's much better than what it was on last gen. But on this gen, it's still not 100% what I would expect. You should be able to grab points of the face and stretch it to certain sizes and stuff like that. Maybe have a click and point now, like a mouse type thing and click and drag stuff instead of these sliders back and forth. I mean, it's still good. It's much better than last gen, like I said, but you can't get the exact look you're looking for. But this is my take on Nico Bellic, which the good thing is you can actually choose Nico Bellic as your father on your heritage part of this. So it makes it that little bit easier. And all you gotta do is just go down I had an actual image of Nico Bella up on my screen while doing this just to try and get it right. He's always got a fat nose and he's got the shaved head with dark hair. Obviously this character at the moment has grey hair, but that does change. Now, I wonder if they're going to implement other characters into the heritage. We had John Marston on last gen. I'm not sure if he's on this gen, on uh, sorry, current gen for the Xbox One or the PlayStation 4, but I would love them to see to add characters for your heritage, new female characters, new male characters like CJ, CJ Johnson, is that his name CJ Johnson? I'm not entirely sure, I can't remember, from San Andreas, maybe even Claude from Grand Theft Auto 3 or Tommy Vassetti from Vice City, it would be awesome to have these different heritage with new characters so you could create essentially people from the old Grand Theft Auto games and do little remake scenes, remake missions and stuff. Especially, I think, when Grand Theft Auto 5 hits PC and we're going to get that new replay, like, recording feature, we will be able to make mini-movies inside of Grand Theft Auto 5. Now, that's going to be awesome. Obviously, when Grand Theft Auto 5 hits on PC, we will go get a shit ton of mods and stuff, so character modification will be unlimited on that front, I think. You'll be able to have any type of character, any person whatsoever. They will literally just put them into the game. But, yeah... This is my Nico Bellic. I hope you enjoy it because I love making these little videos for you guys. It's it's fun. It really is fun. I mean, this video seems to drag out for a little bit, but yeah, just keep watching what I'm doing and you should have a similar style Nico Bellic to what I have. So I'm going to leave you with the rest of this video and I'll talk to you right at the end. Right, so there we go. That is pretty much my Nico Bellic. I stuck the red tracksuit on because I couldn't find a brown tracksuit. I was going to go with the brown suit, but I didn't. I went with the red tracksuit. So if you like this video, guys, stick a like in it. Don't be afraid to comment down below. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe and maybe send me some suggestions of what other characters I could create. And until next time, I shall see you guys later.